Hey guys, it's Jenny from The Bridal Collection. Welcome back to our how-to series. We're gonna be mixing it up a little bit today and showing you how to make a bouquet for your rehearsal and rehearsal dinner. First off, have all of those bows, ribbons, anything that you received handy. Now our box here, we grabbed some brand new bows. Most of the time yours are gonna be left over from that bridal shower. So it's best to have some double-sided tape, maybe a hot glue gun, whatever works best. To start off, you're gonna take a paper plate like so, anything will do. I cut four holes on the plate, basically in the outline of a square. I'm gonna make an X across the front and the back of the plate so that I can secure my bows and ribbons, everything to it. First, I'm gonna take some ribbon, just kind of start threading it through, and I cut everything so it had a little bit of a point on it so it was easier to grab. I'm just gonna pull that through evenly and then take the other side of it and pull that out. Once I have this secured like that, I'm gonna tie a little bit of a bow on the back just to hold it secure. Actually, I think I'm gonna do a knot. I feel like that's gonna hold up better and then we can tie the other side to it. I'm gonna do the exact same thing for the other side. So take that, kind of poke through here, pull about halfway. So you can see I'm kind of starting to form that X on there. And then I'm going to take this on this side and I'm gonna loop it around what I already tied. And then I'm gonna take all of this and tie a bow out of it just to secure it even a little bit more. And it gives you something to hold on to on the bottom of your bouquet. So your plate should look like this with an X on the front. It doesn't really matter what's happening down here on the back, but it does look kind of cute still. So once I have that done, I'm gonna start taking the bows, the ribbon, anything that I received and start knotting that, tying bows around and sticking some bows to it. Now this is your chance to be really creative. Use however much you want, how little you want, whatever colors um, you think are gonna look best. Just have fun with it. All right, so once your plate is starting to look fuller like this, you can keep going if you have more. I clearly do here, but I'm running out of space. You can then start looking at the bottom and how you'd like to secure that more. So these pink strings that I strung through, I'm just gonna kind of knot them together so they don't hang quite as much and look like an added piece. So we're just about finished. I do have this one ribbon that I'm just dying to use. So I'm gonna figure out how to secure that onto the back of my bouquet. So it just gives it a little bit more of a boho vibe and it's something a little bit sturdier to hang on to. All right, and here we are with the finished product. All of my bows are on top here. I think it looks so adorable. I secured it with this fringe boho ribbon that I am just so obsessed with. Um, and now you're ready to walk down the aisle for your rehearsal, getting ready for the big day. Thank you so much, tune in next time.